this beatboxer has caught the attention of world champions like Football G and Collapse. Ooh. <laughs> oh, that was sick. I love the big fierce but why? Well, I personally think that he has the potential to become one of the best beatboxers in the world, maybe even winning GBB. But the question is, why? So here are three reasons why I think so. First up, he has attention to detail. You know, sometimes I wonder, if only I could beatbox that super complex and advanced beat. But the truth is, I can't. And that's so sad, that's so tragic. And I'm sure some of you feel it too. But does Exalos think that? No! Piss and Wing made an insane collaboration and Exalos decided to cover it. Uh-huh. Yeah, it's pretty accurate, right? Wait for it, wait for it. You hear that? You hear that? So good, the details. You see, this is why he's so good. He knows how to listen to it and he uses the skills, which are not easy, to copy it. And that's crazy. And if you remember when His and Collapse did a collaboration together, yeah, he he did a cover of that too. The clicks! Okay. Oh. Wow, I really appreciate how he can emulate and copy that sound design too. So if you can copy the best beatboxers in the world, it shows that you got really good skills. But can Exalos create original pieces? Well, I believe so because the second reason why I think he has great potential is because he has maturity in composition. Here's a really sick beat he made in June. Okay. Oh, that's really good, right? That's dope, that's dope. What's next? 24th July. He likes laser bass. Oh. Heard that? He knows how to use dynamics well. And I appreciate that he's comfortable using silence to enhance the impact of the job. And I think that's a really good mark of a beatboxer who knows what he's doing. So he can beatbox by himself. Great! But even better, he knows how to compliment other beatboxers. Sometime in May this year, Footbox G posted this video. Mm -hmm. He's asking people to hop on this one for a collab. Really clean beat, he's going minimal on the sound design, probably so that other beatboxers can add some bass and different textures. Let's see what Exalos does. Ooh. The snares! Hear that bass? He's adding a lot more rhythm and dimension to the beat, right? So Footbox was using more of the high ends and he's now using the low ends to get you moving. That's really good. All right, so we know he's good at making collaborations. He has the skills for it. He has the attention to detail, but all these are useless if you don't work hard. Is he working hard? I really think so. He's basically been posting beats all year round. Here's a beat from January. Mm, 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 mm. Crazy combo! And here's a beat from July. I love that transition. Wait for it. That's good, that's good, that's good. And we have one from October, just this month. Listen to that whistle. It's really powerful. And covers the high. 
higher and lower ranges of the frequency spectrum. As you can see, all year round he's been beatboxing, been improving, been creating content, generating new ideas, trying new sounds. He's got great momentum and he's probably gonna push forward. But of course, there's always room to improve. So what do you think Exalos can step up to become the next best beatboxer in the world? Drop them in the comments, let me know if I should check out any other beatboxer and I'll see you next time.